Well, this is our starting point and our ending point. Uh, it's uh, about 5.30 in the morning. I'm currently uh, watching the vlogs that uh, Nelly knows from uh, uh, Nelly Tannerite from the uh, Yowie vlogs. And that's kind of where it got my kip my uh, my thing. And I sort of... It, it was sort of in the back of my mind is that they say, well, you're worth it, you are worth it. You, that's what the Yowie stands for, you are worth it. Uh, my refrain is always, well, at some point in time, at some point in time, people always regret my worth, and uh, uh, my answer is uh, no refunds. <laughs> so that's where I got that from. That's just, it was just always, every time they said it, it would just pop in my mind, so that's... And typically, uh, the Yowie Vlogs is my starting point when I'm... When I'm uh, Wandering around YouTube, I have my 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 initial uh, my initial walkthrough and uh, you know my my tour of the neighborhood, and so I go for you know Yowie vlogs. Then it's it's our life. From there, you go to I go to the Leroy's. Uh, from the Leroy's, I go to our family nest. Then from our family nest, it's five family vlogs. Uh, because uh, uh, Clintus isn't uh, vlogging daily anymore, so occasionally I'll go by Clintus. And then I get into the teen set. And then I also have some random as, as well, depending, on, depending on, on, on how the day is going. But I did, get my first, my, I did get my first vlog up. So the first vlog is up. The site, everything that needs to be put together has been put together. So there is the uh, site. There is the Kawaii Tea House TV. That's where our life as Cyborg Alpha is, and it comes out through uh, uh, Cyborg Alpha TV network. So there's going to be more shows there, and you'll see there's already there's already a list of shows uh, that have been done in the past uh, at the site at the uh, Cyborg Alpha TV network. So uh, I'll be adding more content to that. As everything grows and, and evolves. So anyways, uh, I got the temperature down to about uh, 75 degrees. We'll see what the high is today. And uh, the cooling process should work out pretty well. We'll see how things go. Well, it's uh, 2 o'clock in the morning, and I'm kind of a little punch drunk. Uh, <laughs> Got to watch the, the, the sort of the mannerisms. There are things you do that are automatic that you don't necessarily know you're doing until you watch yourself back on the vlog. And you realize, oh, can't do that, can't do that, shouldn't be doing that. It's not that it's there for it's not being done for any particular reason. These are just uh, uh, things that are habitual, so you're not even you're not even realizing that you're doing it at the, at the time uh, when you when you're filming the vlog because you're being the way you normally are. But sometimes you have to sit, sit get in there and sort of uh, adjust the <laughs> behavior uh, so that when you're on camera, the twitches that you normally have don't come through. And what happens is the switches kind of block the view. <laughs> so I have issues with my eyes. I don't like uh, as these little... Uh, uh, and they, they form rapidly. Don't They form uh, enough. Uh, they're these little droplets that form on the eyelid that eventually solidify. And it interrupts the vision. It, it, it blurs my field of view. So I move to take it out of uh, take it out of my eye, but you can't just stick your finger in. You have to be more gentle about it. You have to sort of, you know, brush it out of the uh, eye, uh, of the eyelash because it typically forms within the eyelash. But that doesn't look good, <laughs> and it becomes a sort of a distraction as you're watching the video. You're having a conversation, and all of a sudden, oh, he's going to the eye again. And again, that becomes a, there becomes a, a sort of sense of fin finickiness, where it's not satisfied just to get the one out. You have to go for more, and then you want to see if there is more out there, 
uh, it, it becomes a more involved process than it should be should be because now these are things you're focusing on and you're kind of obsessing on it and kind of and forgetting what the whole video was about. And that's that's kind of the way things are right now. Right now everything's lined up. To, uh, I'm at the I'm at the Tannerites. Uh, I'm at the Yowie vlogs. And so, um, and then the, the, my, my choice for using, um, and then I'm not using their, are you, you, you are worth it thing. My response to it, because I've been watching them for a while, my response has always been sort of a sarcastic smirk or remark. And so, because a lot of times I don't even, I, I get in trouble a lot. I get the people, I say something in my nerdy behavior, someone gets offended, and all of a sudden, whatever I'm worth is not there anymore. But my my particular view is, well, okay, so what? I said this, and so my, the view is, 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 you know, no refunds. <laughs> and, that's the, and that's where the ending of the video, because they do this a lot, and they, this is, they chose to do this at the end of the video. I end the video with, well, whatever is going on, no refunds. And no matter how do you feel, like, no refunds. <laughs> and so it, it, it's a counterplay to uh, the, uh, the 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 title of the, the, their chosen title. You are worth it. So, but that's but that's that's how that's how these things evolve. Uh, and then you, you get comfortable with it. And I said so we're still at the beginning of these vlogs. I did a vlog earlier, but. Uh, a, a couple of years ago, I did a vlog called uh, Big Bang Theory RL, and it was okay, but wasn't as good as it could have been. But the thing is, it, it, it emerged from a particular point of view. So people, people always ask me, "What you? What do you do?" And it's hard to explain to them in a very short sentences. You know, what do you do? Uh, and so I said, "Well, do you know the TV show Big Bang Theory?" Well, I'm a real life version of that. I'm a cross between uh, Sheldon and uh, Leonard. And that kind of got the explanation across in the, in, in the manner that I needed to. And it worked, so it became Big Bang Theory or out. But a large, the, the, the content that I was talking about, the science, was too heavy for the vlog and just kind of weighed everything down. So this is something uh, a little lighter because uh, Cyborg Alpha is a tween. I'm always in school. I'm all, in, right now, I'm on summer break in September. School started up again. Uh, the studying is simply at a different level. But it is still studying. It's still, uh, you know, you, you have your study desk. You, you have your research environment. Your study and research are the same thing. And you have, you put your amount of time in. And think that kids learn from textbooks. I'm going to have to find my information all over the world. And this is done through traveling through the Internet. So I live online, and this is what I've been doing for, for a long time. I've always lived online, and I've lived online as Cyborg Alpha. So this is the vlog of Cel Cyborg Alpha. So we are Cyborg Alpha, the infinite tween. And because of the way it works, because you never really get in, you have infinite knowledge, it's uh, middle school for life. So that's the, the evolution of this. If you will. So, well, it's four thirty in the morning already. So, oh, just about a quarter past. I just got finished watching uh, Family Five vlogs, and now I'm heading over to do some gaming. So I thought I'd end it here. Uh, basically, my schedule works as follows. It's, it follows school almost to the T. Starts in September. I stop uh, for two months in December and January. Uh, that's it's taking time off, but at the same time, while I'm taking my time off, I reorganize my notes, uh, set a direction for where I'm going to go next in the uh, in, in February. And you go from February to basically June 1st. Things start to slow down in May. 
And then beginning June 1st to uh, September 1st, again, it's restructuring, reorgan reorganizing your notes, uh, seeing what upgrades need to be done uh, for uh, the place, for my notebooks, and for the direction that I'm going. In other words, you have to go over the work. When you're going through the research, you have to go over your notes. And it's, it's, things like, it's like history, it's mathematics, science. Uh, all the subjects you would think of in middle school, you took in middle school, they're all there. And you can't really neglect one for the other uh, because each one plays a component in terms of the deeper research. So you really can't say, okay, I'm not going to do this, I'm not going to do that. You really you have to go where the research takes you. So it's, it's, you're not determining where the research is. In other words, there's no hypothesis. Uh, you're allowing the observational work that you do during whatever research you're doing, you allow the observational research to, to sort of set the next direction. So it, it, in many cases, it, because it doesn't have hypothesis, it doesn't have inclusion, because you're not beginning and you're not ending, it's a lot like middle school. You're kind of stuck in between things. And because the knowledge is infinite, you never reach an end. So some days you feel good and you feel really accomplished and things have gone well so far. But other times it's like, you know, everyone's an adult around you and you're not. <laughs> and that's, a, that, that's where your sense of value sort of goes out the window because everyone's an adult and doing the adult things and you're not. And this is where instead of being, oh, well, saying, to, you know, giving myself these positive affirmations which really don't last too long, particularly when you're going to the edges, edges of knowledge. Oh, there goes my Bluetooth. Um, it becomes the flip side of you are worth it as well, even if I'm not worth it, no refunds. That's kind of the, the sort of the situation I've got myself in. So that's it for today's, uh, for today's vlog. Uh, first two vlogs are up and as we say, no refunds.